Mr. Correll. All right, I'm going to be quick on a couple of things. So I want to say something to the, to the um, during the commission meeting. Um, basically, I'm going to give you a letter. I'm going to make it short and simple. I'm not going to read the letter I was going to read, but I'm filing a formal complaint against the Marshall Tally and Tombstone's Marshall Department. I was assaulted by Kenneth Skinner. I was told that um, the case would go up to the county to be looked at. I was told at the last minute at the magistrate office that it wouldn't. Um, I contacted Victims Protection after I went to get a, a, my, my uh, police report and I was charged $5 for it and they told me that they're going to be calling Marshall and telling them that a victim does not get charged anything for the police report. And then I explained to her the case. The county attorney pulled the files, looked at the files, and I was instructed to come into here this evening and to tell the city council to instruct the marshal to send the you're felony out, you're out of order. This, this is wait, wait, completely, I'm not this out is of order. completely inappropriate, Mr. Mayor, for him to you're make out, any you're personal out of order. attacks. I was told you cannot by make any county, personal attacks. I am not attacking anybody. Please sit down, sir. No, I still, have, set, I set still have another pet thing I'm going to talk about. Sit down. I get three minutes. Mr. Mr. Mayor, you said he had two items. Okay, second item. There's no personal attacks against Indian public. That is not a personal attack. That's I'm telling personal. you what the county attorney Go told to you. You will not argue with the city attorney, Mr. Crawford. The city Crawford. attorney should be talking to me. You, you Your will, mayor Mr. 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 Crawford, you will maintain order, okay? I have order. Okay. This evening you were going to pass an amendment to the ordinance 2-9-02. I would like to know why the mayor's wife's business, Old Tombstone Historic Tours, that he manages is allowed to buy a order order daily. Again. I have witnessed stop. as many of the residents that you will, you will stop. For the stage Remove him from the meeting, sir. Okay. Remove him from the meeting. Marshal, would you take his personal belongings out? That's not a personal attack. The reason why Mr. Carrasco has been ejected from this meeting. Anyone else like to speak of public call of the public? I'm just supposed to get you all the way up. Call of the public and go to the next. That is the meeting room. This is the foyer. If you want to arrest me, cite me, cite me. I'm not going to play your games anymore and or his games. I just filed a complaint against him. They removed me because I filed a complaint against him. So if he wants to remove me, Tom, come cite me and remove me. I was instructed to leave the meeting. This leave, is not the meeting. This is a place of establishment for a meeting. You need to leave, please. Okay, there you go. Thank you. Folks, as you can see by this video, this is the foyer out here. This is not the meeting room. I was told to leave the meeting, but the marshal told me to leave here. I would like that put in the official because record for the meeting. Don't, do anything. Don't, don't put that anywhere. You have no right to dictate what goes on here. I'm just asking to put it in the minutes. It's not going to happen. Okay. Bob. Oh. Stacy, uh, you don't want to read about the complaint? Well, okay. Steve, would you like to take one and read about the 
complaint that's going to the county attorney that I was trying to talk about. Where's, where's the other council member? Um, 